Hi guys. Today is Samantha's birthday. But she don't wanna She don't wanna be in the picture. Anyways, let's come and eat. I got her a a uh, ice cream cake from Walmart and it's uh, called strawberry crumble I believe but we're gonna cut it open till tonight did you see how my lash moved it was stuck to one of my lashes ay, 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 que bonito, eh? I did green today let me put you guys right here and I'm not sure if this is too like I got my Valerie wig on Valerie Mallory, Mallory, Mallory. I might have to turn on the light because now that I move my. Might this lamp be giving out already? Oh. Hmm. Okay, guys. So we made in the oven. Um, <clears throat> we had a big pack of pork chops, and we have two big packs of ribs, of pork ribs. So we made barbecue ribs in the oven and corn with cheese and mashed potatoes. And we we're gonna have corn because I didn't have enough for, you know, on my Walmart card. And then this morning when the girls went to get my medication and Julia's medication, they stopped off at the Walmart and got, she did get me the corn. Cause I wanted corn, I like corn. I love corn, especially like guys, <clears throat> let me tell you. Only because, you know, whenever I would go to church and take food, you know, we would always take food. Well, me. Well, me and my sisters in Christ. I'm oh, sorry, guys. Este. Come here. Let me see if I can put this up a little bit. These, these front curlies so they won't get in my hair, you know? Okay, so what happened was that, very uh, ah, 70s, very <laughs> funny. Anyway, no, ahorita me los vuelto, se ve pirotón. No, I like them like this. I like my hair like this, to the side. To the side, to the side. But let's still go like this. There. I'm from New Jersey. Uh... Guys, if you guys, like like I said, when I used to go to church and take my food, I would hear everybody saying, oh my God, who made the corn? Oh my God, who made the mashed potatoes? Oh my God, who made this? Who made that? And it was always me, of course, because I love to cook. So, I told you about the, the secret about mashed potatoes. I don't know if you, well, I'm sure you've got to Golden Corral, right? You know what I'm seeing? These are too thin today, huh? It's because I, I se me acabo mi, mi cena por eyebrow pencil, damn it. Is it too, is it too bright maybe? So we just try like that? Okay. Anyways. That makes my neck look real black like it's throwing you also, but it's not. It's not at all. I probably didn't. Like. Wait. Spread it away. Uh, and I'm serving my stuff and my other nail fell off. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I'm thinking after these, I'm going to take a little break from nails. I should. Este. 
the corn guys I remember this one the this one pastor the wife had gone I think it was a Thanksgiving dinner uh two years ago she says oh my god who made the corn and I'm like me and she was like hermana que le this ah it's falling off Okay, so the bitch was to fall off, huh? I'm not gonna take. I'm gonna take it. Look, it was practically off. I'm not gonna take. I'm just gonna take them off. Cause they're getting me nervous. Okay. You know because the 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 glue that I put on is black, so it looks like regular black eyeliner, right? Bueno. So what you do with the corn is, and I've told you before too. You know, you get your cans of corn, whatever, and you get the juice out, and then you, uh, I've got a big blob of butter. Cheesy wheezy. Yeah, big blob of butter, and... Put the corn in there. You don't need to add nothing. It's butter. Mm. If it's like for a party or a dinner party, and you want to impress people and be like, you know, like you cook badass or whatever, then you get Belvita turkey slices. Belvita cheese slices. I do this like per can, one cheese slice. But on six slices, and then I always buy. We've been lately buying a, a big giant bag of mozzarella shredded cheese from Sam's. Warmer. Thank you. Oh, this is weird. It's crooked. Huh? There. Mm. You mix it around and mix it around and mix it around and let the Velveeta cheese melt in there. You don't have to put salt or pepper. Corn, corn is sweet, so you leave it alone. And after the, the yellow cheese melts in there, it's going to be yummy already. And then you turn it off and sprinkle a lot of the, you know, mozzarella cheese. And then tap alone and just leave it alone. So when you destaparlo and you're going to serve somebody and they taste these two cheesy, buttery, you know, flavors in your corn, they're going to, believe me. They're gonna love it. Mm. Like, my favorite mashed potatoes anywhere is Golden Crow. And I'm sure you've gone there and they have gravy, brown gravy. Sometimes they'll have the white country gravy. I love white gravy. That's my favorite. Thanksgiving comes, I only have white gravy. I mean, brown is good, but. I prefer the white country gravy. <laughs> este, ay, no se ve muy tarde, no puedo ver. Estoy bien vírgula. De por sí. There, eh? So anyways, to me, if you can eat a mashed potato and not have to put gravy in it because the mashed potatoes are so yummy already, then those are bombed. My mashed potatoes are so bomb because I make them um, 
I saw this years ago on the, on the cooking channel, years ago. Where they were making um garlic mashed potatoes. I'll tell you, I'll tell you real, real quick. Terry Marie, thank you for being here. I only remember that name, Terry Marie. I'm sorry. Oh, thank you for being here, Mia. All of you, thank you for being here. Uh, we finna go live pretty soon. Look, my, my red in my eyes almost gone. I'm gonna say maybe less than a week. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. We gotta go live, guys. We gotta go live. And I remember who was here and who supported me throughout all this almost four years of having my. Uh huh. That's why I wanna I wanna give back, you know. I wanna give back, and as soon as money starts rolling in, God willing, I'll be having uh, giveaways, cash giveaways. I I wanna give away uh gifts. I'm gonna cash giveaway. For sure. Este, there's like three new people here that I saw. But we got Tina Marie in the house. Este, so anyways, today's Sam's birthday. She turned 28. I told her to get real pretty, do her hair. No, Mariana. But she took a shower about her hair. Because our hair is curly, right? My real hair. Um, hers is like this, like, you know? And she's one quarter black. Her great grandpa was black. So she doesn't have, her hair is very thick. Kind of like black hair. Very, very, very thick. Uh, Only because she's got a lot of mixing in her, or else it would have it would have come out like you know, very curly. Uh, oh, my mashed potatoes are sunny. These ones Julia made them. Julia did everything for me. I just you know turned on the oven. I was gonna get up right now because I was in bed all day. I'm not gonna lie, my back hurts. I was gonna get up right now, start doing the corn and. The, and I told Julia, and Julia said, it, it should be ready like in 20, 30 minutes. And I said, oh, okay. And then I got up because I said, I'm up. I started painting myself and stuff. And then she tells me, we're going to go get some ice right now. And I said, oh, oh you guys go when I'll do my makeup. And she had already done the corner now. Mashed potatoes. She's got it down to a tea girl. She can cook like me already. All right, so then, garlic mashed potatoes. Um, if you want to do shortcuts, I call them shortcuts because I'll show you a way to. I'll tell you about a way how to cook faster. Um, when you don't have time or you don't want to, or you don't have the things to make everything from scratch, then you do shortcuts. What I mean by shortcuts is. Uh, uh, a recipe calls for garlic and instead of cutting up garlic and stuff you just put garlic powder that's a shortcut to me when I do shortcuts but what I do is I get butter oh no 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 I'm sorry just boil the water for how, however quantity you're going to make of mashed potatoes right? boil the water throw in the scoop of butter I don't put salt, and what I put is nor suiza, the the chicken bouillon, Mexican chicken bouillon is called nor suiza. I put two scoops in there. You get your cumin, cumin. I always say cumin. Your cumin, and you go dash, dash, dash. Your pepper, and then your your garlic powder. 
about a whole shoo, 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 shoo. Then once that bitch starts boiling up and then you just uh hold on guys. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay guys. Sorry. I had to pause it for a minute because um, I saw the FedEx truck right there and I'm waiting for our package. And I, you know, no, no. so I might as well go to the bathroom real quick. I, yeah, so you mash potatoes and then you just, uh, once it starts boiling, shortcut, you add your instant pack box of mashed potatoes in there. And put in a cup of milk and get it with the bean smasher, however you want to do it. Oh, you do get some parsley, parsley flakes also. Parsley flakes, and they looks real fancy like that with the parsley flakes, some little bit of parsley flakes floating up in there. <laughs> this is so good, I can't stop eating it. But I've always... Since I was little, save the best for last. I always save the carne for the end. I don't know why. Oh. Anyways, this is pork ribs. Jesse had some already, my little boy. He said that. He said. It's okay, I guess. <laughs> Okay, it's nice and soft. I like that. Trying to take it up. Because then that's the pick that goes on my, uh, when the video is going to, like, when you're going to search for the video. With the brochote. I know. Working cake boss again. That's fun. I didn't see that. Mm. Shout out to Liz and Angela from the Infectious Center. I'm always headed to the Infectious Center. I always get infections. They're very good people. They treat you really good there. Especially them too. Liz and Angela. Mm. I'd love to go to, to a doctor where, not because you're older, because they're just so doggone sweet. You know, I go there and I would roll in in my wheelchair. I don't have the wheelchair. I have it right here, but I don't use it no more. Amen. My walker, not that much neither. But when Julia would roll me in there, oh my God, they would chipilear me right away. They'd be like, ¿Cómo está, madre? And this and that. I love that. Mm, they tend to you so, so like you're a baby. I love it. I love it. And you can tell that that's their genuine way, you know, being and talking. They're not fake at like me, I call everybody, I call everybody mija, mijo, sometimes papi, mommy, but mostly mija, mijo. Mm. And pelos con huevos, okay guys? Pelos con huevos. For everybody. <laughs> and Tina Marie, is that you in the picture that's pregnant? And that's from the baby from Webb's back, but you know, I'm like, I'm there. No, I'm just kidding. May God bless your baby. Who's calling me? Oh, it's the. Hold on. Make some lemon ice flavors with a nice lemon ice. Refreshing. Okay? 
time to get ready for prayer night, but I don't think we're going to go today because um, I'm not feeling good. Sam's all like lazied out. Julia was starting to get one of her freaking migraines when well, she went up there. Oh, right, we're going. So, um, yeah, Tina Marie and all the new people that I have here. Um, hi, how you doing? How you doing? I love to wear wigs, guys. Did you see the difference from the wig to us? I, uh, I think I'm so ugly. But with the wig, I feel fabulous. Fabulous. And I just colored my hair and I didn't get the canas very good. Look, I can still see some canas there and some here. The grace. Let's get some more corn. My God, guys, this is one of my favorite foods in the whole world. Like ribs. I like ribs. But we never hardly even who make them, though. And. I saw them on special. Oh, but I had them in the deep freezer. And then I usually like, sometimes I don't have money to take my kids out to eat somewhere. But I'll be like, what do you want me to make? I'll make you something what? And Sam said, I don't know. And I was like, you want, we can get you a lasagna at the Walmart. And then we remember that I, I remember that I had the ribs and I said, Do you want rib? Barbecue rib? So, yeah. And it's okay, I'm not ready. Always mashed potatoes and corn. I don't know why Jesse don't like corn. Anymore. How come Jesse stop liking corn, girl? Yeah. I don't know. Well, my baby Justin was little. He was just barely months. Okay, months. We were always down in the restaurants. Cheapy one, expensive one, whatever. My husband loved him to death, so he always had him here. I'd get him out of his little carrier. Out of the little high chairs, put him here, and he taught him how to suck the suck the store out, out of the. He knew how to suck a straw. Real, real young, real, real baby. And he would get his fork, and he loved all the vegetables, guys, especially like peas and carrots. Like we used to go to this restaurant that was a buffet over here in El Paso in the casino and in, in Sandan Casino. They had a restaurant called Ventanas, Windows. And it, it was a buffet. And it wasn't even expensive. Well, what was it? $15, I think, including your drink, something like that. But it was real good. And they had everything. And I would always serve him, like, um, peas. Green beans, corn, all kinds of veggies. We love veggies. So he'll be like, Okay, this fork and he'll go, hmm. And a lot of people will go up to me and say, Oh my god, I can't believe this little boy eats by himself. Oh yeah. And he'll go good by himself too. Just yes, something in him is very trusha. My 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 Julia too. She's got something. Julia, at fourteen, she was already singing in the church. She'll go up to people and pray for them. 
Go on, guys. I'm not lying. Every woman tell me. Hermana, tu hija tiene la unción. She has that touch, and I, I would say, I know. I don't know. That little girl. She's 21 now. She doesn't pray for anybody anymore like that and put hands on them. But at the at our other church, she would. And everybody told me that as soon as she would be like this or even or do touch them, that they would feel that beautiful heat, that beautiful warmth that goes down when you're touched by the Holy Spirit. Yeah. This um, our one of our pastors invited a family to go over there to sing and pray and stuff. And the family lived very far. Well, they start coming every Sunday. So. They became our singers. And so, he shouldn't sing them. Why don't send the blue moon? And uh, now we're at a new at a new church. We've been there for. Let's see. For November, Thanksgiving, we're already at the new church. Because oh, there's September, I think we'll be there for a year already. I like it. I like it there, but just uh, within the last month, they've changed the name. So now we're called Oasis. Oh, this is something. Sorry, guys. There's a piece of corn fell in my boobie. Boobies. Boobies. Woo. Boobies. Check your cheeks, girl. Mmm. That's a line from the movie Glitter. It was kind of like um, Mariah Carey's kind of like okay, like her biography, I guess. I guess the story of her life, kind of. You should watch it. It's old, but it's a good movie. And she has these two best friends. And then one of the other one. Thank you, Gigi, girl. It's a good song. It's a good movie. I love it. It's sad in the end. You know what? Mm. I'm trying to eat better and be on a diet. Not a diet diet, but I'm just trying to eat better, you know? But this thing, these ribs, it would have tasted bomb with Hawaiian bread, you know? The one you can get at Walmart. It looks like little biscuits. And that fucking bread is so yummy. Uh, I've been wanting to make this up. Uh, I've seen this thing on the recipe channel that I watch where you make a gigantic like a gigantic hamburger, you know, with your, let me see, is it 8 by 10, the 9 by 10, the, the pan, the cake, regular cake pan? And you go and you buy the, uh, the Hawaiian bread. And then you slice it like that in half. And you could put on, if you have a big coman, you could put on there and toast it a little bit. But you get a, a I think it's four pounds of ground beef. And you, you know, you add whatever you want to add for your burger. And then you pat it down and put it in this. It could be a big, gigantic square. Put it in the oven. Once it's done, 
You put it on your bread like that. And you put everything you want on there, like a regular burger. I've been wanting to do that for my kids. I want to make them a bacon cheeseburger. But I have to be careful what I put in there. Just, you will just want it plain. Mm. Julia will just want like lettuce, tomato, cheese. Me and Sam, we like onion a lot. No, but I want to make that. And when I do, I'm going to make one. Yes. I don't know if you go like to. Oops, I'm sorry, this one just fell too. If you go get your nails done, <clears throat> next time you go into your nail shop with your nail tech, as soon as you sit down, you'll be like, ask them if. Uh, Look at them real serious like that, you know, and tell them, do you like crystal gel? You want long or short nail? Um, you do not want crystal gel. Yes, you do. No, I'm just looking. So it's Sam's birthday and we didn't get to all eat together. You know, like I said, Sam's just not feeling well. <clears throat> Sam's like, they're like, shooty. But yeah, we're doing some pork chops besides the ribs. This is bomb. Um, I did buy two packs of McCormick seasoning because it comes with the oven bag in the back of it. But it was too much meat and it didn't fit. So we just said, ah, we'll just put it on the regular big ass tray we have. Like half a sheet of cake. Mm. I told me I put, first put some spray. So we bought canola spray now. Usually we just buy the butter spray. Like Pam, you know. But... Lately, lately, we've been getting the cheaper one, though. The Great Valley. You still spray it up. Should put some barbecue. And then put all the... Hey, mi amor. Ah, oh, my puppy here. Puppy chulo. Let me get him some carnita. Tenga, mi amor. Mmm, you're gonna love it. You like it, Otea? You can buy it. Eat it. Did you give him a lot already or what? Oh, they got him a little pop cup when they went to the Sonic right now. Oh, my. Julia got me a banana shake for me and Jesse. She got herself a blue raspa. And Sam got that. What's it called again? Strawberry shortcake. Something. There's a little spider right there, or a fly. There's like a fly right there, those two. It's those flies that look like they're about to die. Okay, you guys. Do you like Quinter Dale? Guys, don't forget. Oh my god, I've been wanting to watch me Vida Loca and I can't find it anywhere. You're going now. You're going now with a vato from another gang. That's both the bitch. You see a la pinche, whatever. Okay, guys, I'm gonna let you go.